Hey there, another video here. In this video, you'll be learning how you can buy BNB from Binance. Alright, so if you have a Binance account, I'm going to be showing you how you can buy BNB from Binance through P2P. Okay, it's a clear step-by-step -step video. Make sure you watch every step. Don't jump it so that you don't miss any points. You know, if you miss any points, your money is gone all right so let's go into the video so what is p2p p2p simply means peer to peer all right so um you are buying directly from somebody there is no middleman there is no central bank of nigeria no anything between you guys but here it is the platform binance that is giving you um the the opportunity to buy from somebody so there are things you need to note here the process on binance is well detailed and you can't lose your money all right so there is a part of binance that is called a screw okay that part ensures that the person you are sending the money to that their assets on binance will be frozen until they release what you paid for all right so you are going to be seeing it in the process as we begin so right now i open up my binance all right so make sure you have a binance account first if you don't have a binance account i'm going to create a video for you you can check the description of this video it might be ready by then all right so i have to log in into my binance all right guys so i've logged in into my binance so what i'm going to do in order to proceed is you can click on here add funds with a variety of payments option right you can click right there so i want to buy bnb this is the same way i'm buying bnb is the same way you buy any other crypto so click on add funds so you are going to see i don't have a crypto asset p2p so i'm going to click on p2p right so right here p2p so you click on p2p so I'm going to be buying live. So you take out time, read everything they'll be showing you. This is the risk. This is what it might take. So I'll say, I agree. This is a quiz. You have to finish the tutorial and everything. Just go through the whole process. I'll click on BNB. So you see it's right here. So make sure this is what I want to buy BNB. If I want to buy USDT, I buy USDT. So this is it, BNB. Then here you can see the list of people selling. Okay, you can see the list of people selling BNB. Okay, you can see the list of people selling BNB. All right, so I'm going to check the one I want to buy from. So you're going to look at the limits here, depending on how much BNB you want to buy. So right here, you're going to see this limit. This person can only sell between 20,000 Naira and 28,000 Naira. And I just want to buy for about 5,000 Naira. So what you notice is that the higher the amount you want to buy, the, the more, the, the, the more you gain. Like this person's price is just 219,000 Naira for one BNB. But if you go down, you see people selling one BNB for 274,000. All right so you have to buy from those who are at the top because it is way cheaper so i'll look for this the person that falls within my category so see this person right here abu machine okay so i want to buy for five thousand naira. i'll click on him so you are going to see it right here now before you buy so i'll click on five thousand naira. so this is the amount i want to buy so I'll click on buy with zero fee. Hey guys, if you are getting value from this video right now, I would like you to subscribe if you are not subscribed and like this video and let me know in the comment section if there is something you don't understand. If you are getting value, let me hear that you are getting value and the video is helpful to you. This is the next page. So this is the next place. So Binance is holding the seller's crypto in a screw account. So that is what the screw account is all about. So Binance is holding their crypto until they make sure that they complete the whole process. All right. So I'm going to go on, click on next. 
So make payments and the rest. So before you start, so look at the time limit that Binance is giving you to make payments. All right. So this is the time limit they are giving me. So make sure you make the payment within this time limit. So, but before I make payment, I have to confirm if this person available. Okay, I'm going to chat him up. Okay, he said, yes, he's online. Okay, so I'm going to proceed to making payments right now. So I'm click on make payments. So this is the bank account where I'll be transferring to. Okay, I have to copy it and go and make payments. So I'm going to go right now, go and make payments in my bank. So when you are paying, make sure you don't write anything related to crypto in the person. Don't write um, BNB, don't write BTC, don't write Binance. Just write something, maybe your name, all right? So that the account will not be seized by central bank because it's not accepted for those in Nigeria. So I'll click on transfer. So once you do the transfer, make sure you screenshot. This is it screenshot your receipt okay and you proceed back to binance and say transfer notify seller so upload proof so i'm going to upload the proof which is the receipt of the payment i made so this is it that's the proof of the payments i made so that is the now the process i've completed it Okay, so I'm now waiting for him to release my crypto, all right? 5,000 Naira uh, BNB to be released, all right? This is actually my first time of buying any crypto on Binance on P2P. So if I can do it, I'm showing you the first process so that you too can do it for yourself. All right, so this is it. He has deposited it. He has given me my 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 BNB right now, I click on done. Okay. So the order is completed and it was very, very, very fast. So they asked, can I put um, a comment? So because it was very fast, I put a positive comment for him. And genuine. Uh, let me leave right leave comments so that is it so i have right now my bnb okay so the next process if i want to buy wikicard is to transfer my bnb to my wallet all right so i'm going to be showing you that also how to transfer bnb to trust wallet and so that I can use it and now buy the coin and swap on pancake swap for those who want to buy wiki card and any other coin you want to buy. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my wallet when I want to transfer. I'm going to my wallet. So my wallet, you can see right here on my wallet, I have only $6.5, which was gotten by from BNB. I'll go to spot trading. I'll go to withdraw. So when I go to withdraw, I'm going to see what I have there, which is BNB. So I'll click on BNB. He said, send via crypto network, send via email, phone number. So it's via a crypto network, right? Because it's going to my trust wallet. I click on crypto network right here. So you get it. So right here, I'm going to put the address of the person I'm sending to. So if you are buying for yourself, you are sending, you are go going to get your BNB address on Trust Wallet, right? You select the net um, network, which is BEP20, then you select the amount, and that is it. Go to my Trust Wallet. So, so I'll go to my, this is my Trust Wallet, and I'll go to my BNB. So this is my BNB, and I'll click on Receive BNB, and I'll copy it right now. I've copied it. So the next thing is I'll just come here, paste, paste it here, right? So this is it. It went automatically. I'll click on maximum to send all of them. They'll just charge you like $1 charge. 
all right so this is it the whole contract address i've put it once i put the contract address binance had to complete the remaining one for me so i'll just click on withdraw okay it says this correct click on confirm all right so said click on confirm all right so depending on the network verification code have been sent so i have to wait to verify and this is it success it has been withdrawn just like you can see on the screen success view history and you are done all right guys so um thank you for watching that video if you've watched the video and you watch all the video on how to get bnb and also maybe to convert it on trust wallet but you are still confused you are not getting it very well so here is my link you can reach out to me on whatsapp to help you so here's my link you should also find it in the description of this video or on the pinned comment section right so until then see you next time bye bye